Uh, yeah, I mean, look, yeah, they just totally dominated the game pretty much after about, after probably 20 minutes, uh, possession and, um, yeah, look, second half was just, yeah, I think about 200 more tackles or something and, uh, yeah, and they were, to their credit, you know, they were ruthless tonight, uh, I thought they played really well, looked like a team on a mission, um, I've seen that before, last round, you know, in, under the circumstances, you know, we didn't, um, you know, I thought we started the game with plenty of intent, but in the end it was, you could see who was getting, marching on and who wasn't. Yeah, we, we started the year with, uh, uh, I guess the biggest intention was to build a, um, a foundation for, for the future. Um, um, you know, we started the year with some good, tight, hard wins uh, against, you know, fancy teams. Um, uh, but there was, I guess, a bit of a pattern through our year where, um, you know, our, our, our sort of the level that we found ourselves at was, you know, we were good as underdogs. Um, so whether that, that was in actual games or even during games where we'd, we'd get ahead or things were going well and all, you know, we'd sort of find our way back into a scrap. And that's sort of how, how it became, you know, we became scrappers. And, uh, you know, defensively I thought we have made some real strides this year, you know, our club's never been known as a defensive club. Um, and if you're going to be successful, you have to, I think history shows that you have to be, you know, strong defensively. I think we made some real strides in that, in that area. So, um, you know, 12 wins, most wins since 2011, I think so. Um, but, you know, obviously we're, you know, we're not there. So, that's... Um, well, a couple of wins, I suppose. Uh, yeah, when you, you, you finish where you deserve, I think it's probably fair enough. We're just just outside, but not there yet. Um, I think our season would probably suggest that. So, yeah, um, plenty of work to do, but it's always going to be a you know a long road ahead. So, um, in a build, and I think we take we took uh, some good steps this year, but lots of work to go. Yeah, I've, I've said what I've said about that. I mean, I'm, you know, I have a contract here. I've said all I need to say. Um, I get that, you know, people want to discuss it. Um, I get there's, um, you know, the gender about various things outside the game, but, you know, I think I've um, made my position clear, so. You spoke about misinformation. I mean, this is sort of chance, last game, clear some of it up. Do you want to clear any of that stuff? No, I don't, because there's, the you know, there's so many different stories being written, Brent. So there's obviously misinformation. So you know, I'm pretty clear, clear that I was I was disappointed, I and mean, why wouldn't you be? So, but I've, you know, as I said, I've made my peace on that. Do you think it'll die away now? Do you expect it to keep going? I've no idea. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I, I, you know, I can't speculation, speculation. I can't. Deal in that. I've just got to deal with what I've got in front of me. That's what I do. Yeah, it's a near miss. We, uh, as Ivan said, uh, you know, we're played some uh, big games and we come out on top. And then when we were favourites, we uh, couldn't seem to. Uh, we, we struggled in those games, and some games when we were leading, you know, we struggled to put the game away. And, um, yeah, we learned a lot this season uh, as players, as a playing group, and uh, you know we're still building. And but yeah, obviously all the players are disappointed uh, not making the eight. Uh, but as I said, you know, get what we deserve, and you know, South showed uh, yeah where, where we need to be tonight. They were ruthless in their defence, and they just shut us out of the game, uh, especially their second half.